Hello everyone, this is Dr. Juwan. I did a couple previous videos on this supplement called Tutka. Now the first video I did is what is Tutka? The second video I did is the benefits of Tutka. And now I'm gonna show you the mechanism of Tutka, which is a phenomenal supplement. Now again, I don't promote any brands in particular. I do my own research, so I always recommend for people who ask me questions, but I appreciate it, to do your own research because I cannot promote any single brand due to copyright laws. But yes, I appreciate the comments and the questions. Thanks for watching. Hello everyone, this is Dr. Jawad. Welcome to my channel. If you're a newbie, welcome. If you're a, re a repeat customer, thank you very much and welcome back. For the newbies, all I ask is four things. Very, very simple. One, hit the subscribe button down below, the bell notification, so when I upload videos like this, you'll be first to be notified. Hit the like button. I always appreciate a lot of likes. And also, in addition, please leave a comment. Say anything, ask a question. As I do, you, as you see below, I will answer questions. However, if you want to schedule an appointment, a one-on-one, -on -one, either Zoom or phone call, or if you're in the area, stop on by, visit my website and you see the Book Now button. Hit the Book Now button and it'll take you over to the, pay, the scheduling page. So, we can, so I'll be more than happy to answer any questions that you may have. I always appreciate it. By the way, thanks for watching. Okay, so when it comes to Tutka, the mechanism, this supplement is amazing when it comes to the mechanism. Now, what it does is, again, remember, it's very, very, very beneficial to the liver health, basically your overall body health. How does it do it? First, it increases the glucose-induced insulin release by the way of the CAMP and the PKA pathway, which in turn is going to increase insulin sensitivity. We need this. What this pathway is involved in, why it's so important, because it's a gene protein coupling receptor triggered signaling cascade used in cell communication. So you're going to increase the communication between the cells. Next, it relieves the endoplasmic reticulum stress. Now the endoplasmic reticulum makes sure the proteins are folded properly. Now the ER function is to make proteins, produce proteins for the rest of the cell to function properly. There's two types of endoplasmic reticulum, the smooth endoplasmic reticulum and the rough endoplasmic reticulum. Next, reduces this programmed cell death. What is this programmed cell death? The programmed cell death is called apoptosis. Now apoptosis could be our best friend and our worst enemy. The cells, they have a lifespan. So when they come off their lifespan, their expiration date, they die. The average red blood cell has a 120 day life expectancy. So by day 120, that red blood cell, apoptosis, makes it explode and die. So we need that, but also not too soon. So when it comes to programmed cell death, it, this Tutka prevents the molecule BAX, BAX, from reaching the mitochondria. Now Bax, what it does, it's an apoptosis regulator. So you don't want to get the Bax too close to the mitochondria too soon because the Bax will cause the mitochondria to release cytochrome C, which causes the enzymes uh, capases to initiate apoptosis. So it kind of holds it back. Now remember, the mitochondria produces ATP. What's ATP? adenosine triphosphate and that is our energy currency so if you attack the mitochondria you're going to damage your whole cell you're going to, you're basically going to damage your whole system so you don't want that bax molecule to attack the mitochondria next it inactivates bcl2 bcl2 is associated death pr promoter now bax the bax molecule is part of the bcl2 family so they work hand in hand so basically it's their hand in hand it's a molecule involved in apoptosis. So what it does again, it inactivates it. You don't want that. Lastly, it removes toxic bile acids from the liver and prevents them from damaging liver cells. How does it do that? Remember, Tutka is a water-soluble bile acid. Bile is water-soluble and fat-soluble, so it has opposite ends. You need the bile to clean things down. I always say bile is like the detergent that scrubs out the grease from the pan. Tutka is like that final rinse. So it gets all that uh, toxic bile out of the system. Now it comes to doses. 
doses, the good news is there's no side effects of Tutka. The only side effect is that you're gonna be feeling better. So with a Tutka dosage, anywhere from 500 milligrams to 1,000 milligrams daily. Now remember, Tutka improves overall liver health. So I always double it with either N-acetylcysteine, glutathione, 1,000 milligrams to 1,500 milligrams on an empty stomach. And if you, want also, if you also want to go the herbal pathway, milk thistle. Milk thistle as well will help clean up the liver cells. So I hope this helps. I hope you understand this. Please leave a comment down below. Remember, subscribe, the bell notification, hit the like button, and I'll see you on the next video. Please leave a comment. Thanks for watching.